Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. You're welcome to Saturday, the 4th of January, 2020. Today's Seeds of Destiny, uh, the first weekend of the year 2020, is yes, you can do it. I know that the chartered accountants of I can say, I can, can you? Well, let's look at what our scriptures tells us today. The Bible says, and Peter answered him and said, Lord, if it be thou, bid me come unto thee on the water. And he, and he said, come. And when Peter was come down out of the ship, he walked on the water to go to Jesus. Matthew 14, 28 to 29. Praise the Lord. Thought for the day. If you believe you can walk on anything that is trying to walk on you, you can dare what others dread. It is confirmed that audacity is key to achievement in life. You can attain any height in life if you believe you can. This is very true. For instance, Peter ordinarily would not have dared walking on the water if he did not see Jesus do it. And if he did not believe he could walk on the same water after the command of Jesus, he would not have possibly attempted it. In Matthew 14, 28 and 29, the truth is, if you can rise above any situation of life, if you can believe you can, then you can become anything you desire to become. If you believe that big project, that dream or that plan in your heart that looks so big to be actualized can be achieved this year 2020 if you can believe the possibility without entertaining a doubt in your heart. Now, some people think that Peter walked on water Whereas, he actually walked on the word of God. My, my, my senior pastor says he walked on com, C-O-M-E. He walked on the word. And um, when Jesus spoke, come, he walked on the C-O-M-E in Matthew chapter 14 and verse 29. That word C-O-M-E crystallized and became a carpet on the water for Peter to walk on. Hallelujah. Now, this means that if you can locate the relevant word concerning that situation, you can walk on it. Just like Peter walked on the water with the revealed word of God, you can walk on anything that is trying to walk on you. You can walk on barrenness. You can walk on cancer. You can walk on tuberculosis. You can walk on peptic ulcer disease. You can walk on hepatitis. You can walk on HIV AIDS. You can walk on failure and poverty and chronic singleness. You can walk on barrenness. The word of God is there for the basis for human possibilities. And today, I release on you the grace to locate the right word and the power to dare what others dread. The grace to conquer your confrontation comes upon you now, in Jesus' name. Yes, you can do it. Remember this, yes, you can do it. If you believe you can walk on anything that is trying to walk on you, you can dare what others dread. Hallelujah. What's our assignment today? Number one, believe that you can. Secondly, never the doubt the word of God to you. And thirdly, do not be afraid of doing what others avoid. That they fail does not mean you will fail as well. Praise the Lord. Let's pray. Say after me, Lord, I thank you because I can do all things through you who strengthens me. I connect the grace to believe, the faith to believe your word. Help me in 2020 to do the impossible, to surmount the unsurmountable, and to dare the undareable, to achieve the unthinkable. Oh Lord, in Jesus' name, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Now before I close today, let me pray with somebody who wants to be born again. You want Jesus to be the Lord of your life? Simply pray this after me. Say, Lord Jesus, thank you for dying for my sins. Come into my life. Be the Lord of my life. Wash away all my sins. Make me a new person. From today, I turn my back on sin. I turn my back on the devil. I will live to please you, O Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah.
is a place of revival. It is a place.